typically people, their first edits, they come to Wikipedia to vandalize it, so I, I, I vandalize something on Wikipedia. And when I vandalized Wikipedia, immediately somebody reviewed it, and they said, you're doing something inappropriate, and they undid what I did. So I, I reflected on that. I came back a couple years later, vandalized Wikipedia again. You know, I, I still had an appetite to disrupt it. This was my relationship with Wikipedia. Four years of vandalism, and then I decided to be a, a, a good member of the community. And from that point, I started editing almost every day. I used to edit more regularly, but now I mostly edit when I see like a typo or something small that I want to correct. We call them gnome edits. The last article that I created from scratch was when I was a student here at NYU. It was about revenge porn. I created that article. I am not paid at all uh, for editing Wikipedia. It's completely a community, volunteer-based effort. So for me, it's just a way of giving back and ensuring the validity and the accountability and legitimacy of Wikipedia as a source. And personally, I believe knowledge should be free, open, and accessible to all. And language, technology, and internet should not be a barrier. So in, like, uh, in rural communities, if you go to a teacher, they genuinely want to help you, but at the same time, their knowledge is also restricted. So at max, they can say, like, go to the library, which is also having limited books. And that's why like, my primary focus is to make sure at least health-related content on Wikipedia is up to date. And if I look back, my life will be completely different if you remove Wikipedia from my life. I don't know that I would call myself a superhero for editing Wikipedia, only because I think it's so easy for anyone at all to create an account and start doing these edits themselves. I really like being a Wikipedian. It isn't this thing that only tech nerds can do. The common bond between us is that we are sharing this information for free online with the intent to educate the public about what's important to us.